No the dudes, welcome back to another Indecisive Inventory review. Today we are talking about Thor the movie. Um, right off the bat, it is very bland, very boring. It will it will not, you know, really entertain you that much, honestly. Uh, it'll do the bare minimum of keeping keep keeping you, I don't know. Keeping you looking at the screen. That that's it. That's all it's gonna do. Alright, it ain't doing much more than literally okay, oh, oh look, it's a movie. Oh, that that's it. It's, 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 it's a freaking movie. Anyway, I should, you know, tell you about that. Uh, you know what the actual movie is about. And if you haven't watched it. Um Okay, basically, you know, Thor is kind of an asshole. He's just like, Hey, screw you, man. Um I'm I mean I'm royalty or whatever, and he's gonna, you know, be the king of Asgard, whatever shit. He's got an adopted brother. Um and then you know his uh, Loki, you know, which is great, who's great, um, you know, he finds out he's a frost giant, you know, yeah, that sucks, you know, yeah, it's kind of, kind of, you know, stuff to find out you're adopted, yeah, uh, probably sucks for him, you know, oof, man, um, but yeah, uh, he, get, he gets, you know, big, big ragey mad, uh, or whatever, um, both of them actually, uh, Loki gets mad that he's adopted, because, well, you know, he's adopted, uh, Thor gets mad because, you know, he, uh, Frost Giants ruined his uh, party or whatever his uh, yeah his party and he's like um, well you know gonna get sent to Earth because he needs to get his ass humbled um, by his dad uh, Odin anyway well, I'm not gonna let this it's this movie's not very uh, uh, you know this movie's just hard to get excited about or you know even talking about it it's just very whatever um, it's a very bland. Uh, action sci-fi movie whatever you want to call it I don't know. <laughs> um it's you know it has loki you know which is nice i, I like loki you know loki's always fun uh you know because you know kind of funny is seeing him just mess with thor uh, all the time and how many times thor just falls over or whatever uh <sighs> i don't know just characters are very bland they're just they're just kind of whatever man you you, again, nothing exciting. Like if you're if you're if you want to see an actual like, like, you know, well well written you know story driven movie, with, like good you know good characters and stuff. Th this isn't really it for you. I mean, if you're if you really want to watch uh, Thor's first movie, you know it's, it's cool. I guess um, yeah, it's up to you. I guess. But it's just, it's not going to give you much, right? It will not give you much to work with. Um, yeah, basically, you know, um, Odin's, you know, Odin gets mad at Thor that, you know, he's being an asshole. So he sends it to Earth, you know, takes his hammer away or his powers. And then he's like, all right, go humble yourself, you know. And then, you know, he humbles himself because uh, Loki, Loki got mad that he's adopted. And uh, he's, by you know, by the Frost Giants. And then he sends like some kind of a... Destroyer or whatever to destroy Thor and then he's like, okay, I'll just sacrifice myself I'll just let him be the shit out of me and then he's like, okay, then he gets his hammer back because that's what it, that's how it works You know, it's based on worthiness or whatever and then that's it the end of the movie. That's pretty much it I mean, you know, like there are other stuff like, you know, those scenes in Asgard, which is, you know, Asgard, it kind of looks cool I guess, yeah, it's, it's alright, but um, uh, Jane Foster, you know, it's a, she's like a scientist or whatever. She's got like sidekicks like uh yeah, psychic. I don't know. I forget the names. Uh, anyway, uh, yeah, there's just like a smart scientist, which is weird because uh, I mean, I don't know what wh who what person is gonna believe this crazy crazy dude who says, "Oh yeah, uh, I'm an alien from another planet, uh, and I'm you know I'm gonna find a magic hammer, uh, and then I'm gonna go back to my alien planet, whatever the hell." Uh, and then and then she falls in love with him because uh, you know he's attractive. That's it. That's that's the only. I'm pretty sure that is literally the only reason. Uh, you know they fall in love because they're attractive. You know that's that's the that's the basis of any strong relationship, right? Yes. Um. Anyway. Um. Yeah. What is what is there? Uh, Jane and Thor fall in love. Uh. Loki. You know does Loki things. Uh. That's about it, man. There's not that much to it. it. It's very just, it's very just, like, a lot of it is just, like, I don't know, pointless action machines. I mean, not completely pointless. There's something to it, I guess. I don't know. Um, just, just very, I, they try to make it seem epic or, you know, grandeur or whatever, like, you know, like, royalty or whatever. Um, like, you know, ooh, whatever the, whatever the hell I'm trying to say right now. Um, anyway, yeah. 
Uh, Dolor. What would I give it? Honestly, uh, I would give it. <sighs> mm. See, okay. I honestly, I would give it like. Uh, uh, yeah, it's kind of hard, but I would. Uh, I would have to give it honestly. Uh, I'd have to give it a six out of ten. Yeah, um, I would have to give it a six out of ten. It's not, you know, the. It's not a. It's not a horrible movie. It's just. There's nothing to get excited about, man. Like, don't you, you know, when you watch a movie, you want to like, you want to be engaged by anything at all. Okay. Even if it's, even if it's something bad. Okay. You want to at least be interested by it, you know? Oh, okay. Hey, look at this thing. This, this thing is shit, you know, but I want to talk about it. You know, there's nothing, you know, there's nothing like overly horrible or anything. Um, oh, wait, actually, no, wait, I forgot about the Dutch tilts. Yeah. It's, uh, I just remember the Dutch tilts, of course. Yes, that that was horrible. That that was what the fuck, bro. Like I broke my neck trying to watch that shit. All right, like I thought, you know, I, I don't know. I, I was I was what like I was well, a lot younger. Um, what I watched this a long time ago, like when I was an actual kid, and I thought, oh well, wow, okay, did, what was this some sort of like professional thing? Like I was being I was being I was being really stupid there, and I was like. Oh, is this is this how professionals like shoot films like this way? You know, to make it seem, I don't know, professional or some shit. You know, but you know, I was I was I was a little kid. All right, go easy on me. All right, I was a little kid. I had no idea that. Yeah, no, it's just. Uh, I mean, I guess you know it is a thing that people do. I guess, but it is absolutely horrible. Really, just oh my god, I, I don't know why. Instead of instead of you know making trying to make it seem epic, why don't you, why don't you actually you know, make the movie app, you know? Um, yeah. But yeah, there's not that much else to talk about. I don't know. I'm just... Yeah, I mean, that, that's about it. Anyway, yeah, I would give this movie a 6 out of 10. 60%, whatever the hell. Um, yeah. If you're a hardcore MCU fan, and... Well, actually, first of all, if you're a hardcore MCU fan, you, you probably watched every movie already, but... Um, yeah. If you're, if you're just a casual fan, uh, there's no point in watching this. Um, I don't know. Unless you want a dumb, dumb, dumb movie that, that doesn't really, you know, it's not very entertaining or anything. It's just kind of black. It's very, it's very bland to be honest. Anyways, yeah, I'm just rambling on. Uh, thank you for watching. Uh, hope you enjoyed this review. Whatever, you know, it's me rambling, rambling about shit. Uh, yeah, thank you for. Oh my god, I'm saying it again. Uh, I will see you in my next video. Um, yeah, I don't know. Sometime I'll see you in another time, and if I never see you again, have a have a nice day or whatever. Uh, yeah, peace.